For sports news now, 25 elite coaches have embarked on their CAF uh, coaching course journey today. The course aimed to enhance the coaching skills and expertise of local trainers, ensuring they are equipped to lead teams at both grassroots and elite levels. In this class are consistent from class D and they have maintained their tempo. And if you look at them, most of them have been in football for so long. Most of them have played even football and uh, they have been consistent and they are here today. And it's encouraging because uh, at times you can train but people fall out. Giving knowledge to coaches is one of the best uh, thing you can do because uh, whatsoever gives you a knowledge, then I think it's an entire uh, lifetime investment. I started with my CAF D, went to the CAF C, CAF B, and now eventually I've had an opportunity to uh, do uh, CAF A. So I'm very, very uh, elated and I think uh, brighter days lie ahead in as far as Kenyan football is concerned. If uh, the federation is empowering players, having those activities that can, can empower players, that can make coaches grow, can make the game grow, uh, I, I think for us as Kenya Footballers Welfare Association, we can give it 100% uh, support and I believe we are heading the right direction. Moving on, a rising starlets jetted into the country from Angola where they thumped their host four goals to nil in their third round return leg match. Starlets had won 